Hey YouTubers, this is Lonnie Clark, Nuts for Art. Uh, I want to address a comment that I had on one of my videos today about they're tired of us anti-nukers complaining and being death doomers and Dana Durnford's wasting his time because he's not scientific and Kevin Blanche has chased people away because he's too volatile or whatever. Really, this is the thing. If you have solutions, please link them to the video. And you know what? I apologize if I get terse with people about suggesting that you get off your ass and do something. If you have done things and I don't know about it, you know, please accept my apology on the front end. I try not to be really a snot about asking people to get out there. But I'm stunned that most of our population doesn't really care if they're, if they're getting cancer, their kids are getting cancer, they're having problems with their eyes, their ear, their nose, their throat. We're having high rates of birth defects. I mean, cancer is not coming. We have high rates of cancer and leukemia right now. We have a multi-billion dollar industry off of it, in fact. And so it's, it, it is not nuclear is going to harm us. Nuclear has harmed us, and nuclear is going to continue to harm us. And we need to demand that science figure out a way to stop the harm that nuclear radiation is causing right now. And we need truth in medical reporting instead of them covering it up and if anything else could cause contamination or the cancer or any of that then that's what they blame they don't even talk about the nuclear contamination the story recently that came out about oh it's going to peak in 2015 is a pile of shit how can it possibly peak when there are three nuclear power plants still melting down in Fukushima right now it's getting worse leaks everywhere <coughs> Excuse me. So, I'm going to just post this video up. But look, if you have ideas, put the links down because we really need to get behind your ideas. If you have them, we want them. And I don't mean to be a bitch about it, but I'm really sorry if people get offended when I say get off your ass and get going. But, you know, the truth is, I'm just now getting off my ass and getting going since 2004. I mean,. Actually, when Bush stole the election, I wasn't even off my ass then. It took until they actually killed Pat Tillman. That's when it really got me was when they set up Pat Tillman. I watched all the hearings. It was obvious what happened. If you watch the hearings, you know what happened. We've had a coup inside the government of the United States. And frankly, that's why the nuclear industry is out of control. Because they're the part of the arm that is controlling our government. So it is time for us to stop. Stop attacking each other. Start helping each other. Give links. Accept apologies. Let's move on. Okay? So I'm going to end here, and I'm going to read the book. And I'm actually thinking that I'm going to actually start reading Uncle Tom's Cabin. But that's kind of a hard book to read because you have all those dialect inflections. But it's a great book, and I'm not so sure that many Americans will read it. It's a really awesome book that's fundamental to what's going on in today's world. So I'll talk to you guys later, and I hope uh, this is met with the kind of open heart that it was meant to be received with. Like, seriously, no harm done. I don't mean to offend anyone. I want us to come up with solutions. I'm not a doomsayer. I believe we're here on purpose. There's a reason why we're here. We don't have all the solutions, but they come to us if you go at it with a, an open heart, with love and you know, just determination and refuse to be offended, for goodness sakes. So, ciao, you guys.